Hey, it's Ninja Boy. Welcome back once again to Mushroom Kingdom Meltdown onto Frozen Hill. Also, it's Mushroom Kingdom Meltdown 2. But, uh, alas, it is the freaking frack is uh, you. Do, 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 do. <laughs> I think this is Banjo Kazooie music, but it's so weird. Also, I think I've seen this room already <laughs> once before. Maybe. Maybe not. I'm not really sure. Such an odd thing. Well, I was not expecting that. I thought that was just a solid bridge. Also, that's a moon that I'm guessing uh, those are fire flower bo blocks. What are you, you giant snowman? You are so weird. Also, I want to see if there's... Well, there is a thing. Let's go up this way and see what is over here. Ah, that's how you get the moon. I'm... You could probably get that with a normal jump, but uh, again, having the cape was uh, beneficial. So that got me a moon. Such weird snowmen. So weird. Um, and you, oh, what the? You can bat those away? I didn't know that. I mean, I've seen the uh, snowman guy before. I didn't know you could actually bat those away, and also you cannot spin jump, or spin, cape the uh, snowman dudes. Yeah, that's so weird that you can, like, bat those away. That's something I did not know. And uh, getting up here and going to the next level. And <laughs> that's the end of the level. Okay. Okay, I will... I will accept it for now. Still find it utterly weird, but I'll accept it for now. Green switch. Okay. S okay, so yes. I'm just going to sit here and like. Uh. Cape whip. Cape spin. So it looks like I'm spinning around. Thanks to, uh. The super fast blocks. Okay. Well, now I'm in the Green Switch Palace. So, that's all I had to do. I had to do that one level to get to the Green Switch Palace. I was expecting, like, a full-fledged world, to be honest, because of the castle that was over here. Um, so, there might, in fact, be a full-fledged level, but, uh, or full-fledged full world, but, uh, I was... I was expecting that to be a full world after that level. Anyway, let's go on through the cave back over to where I'm supposed to be. As I need to sneeze. Okay. I sneezed. Grassy Hill 5. Kind of a pee balloon. There's munchers! No, I don't want a muncher. Oh, great. Yep. And I'm not small. <laughs> oh, that is so, so weird. No, I don't. <sighs> this is going to be... Because I am I still have, like, the big hitbox, but I'm small. So this is going to be very, very awkward. Yum, 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 yum. What the frick of frack are you? You're like, oh, you're a ball and chain. That's who you, what you are. Yeah, see, I'm not even, like, touching those yet. I'm getting hurt by the munchy munches. Well, I can spin. It doesn't really like it when I spin, because it's just awkward. I'm wondering if I can... Frick. Okay. Yeah, I'm wondering if I can, uh... What's it called? Bap away those uh, fire things that come out. Because I do technically have a cape, even though this uh, should not give me a cape. What the? What the? What is that thing? I'm guessing. 
Okay, before I do that, uh, are, are you sure you want to touch that? That is an evil bonus round. When you touch it, you are transported to a rougher area. Sure, I'll go in here to uh, Negative World and try and uh, get through here. Okay. See, one of the main problems with this is because I'm big, not big, uh, my hitbox is not going to allow me to uh, get through here without taking a hit, which is pretty annoying. Also, those are impervious to fireballs. So, such a weird uh, thing. Being big, not big uh, in this. That is a big flaw. You'd think uh, the, what's it called? Uh, item take you away blocks would uh, exist. Also, there's no way for me to get through there without taking a hit. So, now I am forced to be tiny. Also, I'm not a fan of you. There we go. Get past him, get past that. Being small does make this a lot easier, but uh, at the same time, it is kind of annoying because I don't want to be small. However, I will take the cape. I saw you. Yes, I can bat those away. So, that was the secret exit. Where does that go? It goes down here to... Desert Fortress. I've... I already did the Desert Fortress. Why would it take me... I don't know. Shortcut, maybe, so I don't have to go through the mine completely. Anyway, I will be right back. Okay, I'm back to where I was when I went through there, and I'm not going to go through there again right now. Also, yeah, so if you do this, um, it tends to spit more, and I'm not quite sure why, but uh, it's kind of fun to do. So, I'm not sure why I'm getting these uh, question... question? exclamation coins. Also, for anyone curious, uh, it was, uh, what was it? I forgot. It's like boom or something. I don't know. Um, yeah. So, I, I don't remember. Because I was mentioning, someone's like, oh, you should call them this. Because apparently that's a thing on the internet. Kind of like hashtags for the pound key. Um, yeah, I, I don't I don't remember. I saw it yesterday, and I actually no, it wasn't yesterday. It was this morning that I saw it, and I don't even uh, remember what it was. Technically, I guess I guess when this goes up, it would have been yesterday that I saw it. So uh, that statement is correct. It was yesterday for you, this morning for me, uh, that I saw that, and I can't remember what it was and I it's getting bugged the crap out of me so I'm gonna go look it up uh, really quick okay I remembered what it was cuz I went and looked it up it was bang I don't know where that came from to be honest but uh, that is what I was thinking of is bang so that's a thing that exists on the internet that calling an ex exclamation point a bang um, can I make that? Yes, I can. Hmm. And can I do the trick? Maybe. Probably not with a uh, floating down. Oh, is there... Yes, there is a thing. So I could do that to get the springy board. Because then it's like, oh, hey, now you need to hit this shell. Also, I don't really care about all the coins, so I'm just going to take this springboard. It'll give me a one-up. And those explode. Bounce. Boing. Ah, and 
Um, okay, those weren't normal Goombas, apparently. Those were, uh, dying like one-hit Goombas. Pop. I thought they would flip over. Yeah, like that one. No, the one that I caped whipped, uh, completely died. But now I can... Well, I did have running ability. But, um, end of level? End of level. Freaking... <laughs> really, really short levels. Uh, I I have to wonder if a lot of these shorter levels were made with the intention of actually being short or an idea was formed and it was never really finished. But anyway, Water Climb will be next time in Mushroom Kingdom Meltdown 2. This has been Ninja Boy, and I will be back later with more of this. See you guys then.